Here's your money. Thank you. Oli kolmi sormis mai, oli reikä rauta braun. Ja tapahtuma paikana oli Jackson Willy Town. What's the commotion? You a loon or something? This night folk country. Night, night folk. folk? I can look after myself. <laughs> okay. Maybe you should clear out though, if you're so troubled by things of the night. It's night, folk. And I would, it's just... be on my property. Hey, w would you help me uh, get them off? Well, I, I I'd pay you for your troubles. You pay me, huh? Maybe. Wanna show me where this place is? We'll see. All right. Let's go. Hey, it's just over there. You good man, partner. <laughs> Them night folk would put me on a pipe. They got their paws on me. Oh. Hang me up on a hardwood hammock. Boy, I'm lucky I ain't dead as it is. Night folk. Oh, they bad people. Bad folk. Animals. A lot of them. You know... I ain't never heard no night folk speak. There's not been one peep out of no night folk. Not that I ain't heard it, at least. Imagine not uh, the the Can you fathom that? Mm, mm. What kind of evil don't make no sound? It's bad, all right. Bad. I mean, I don't meet many folk out here on my own, the most part. But I still speak, you know. Well, I talk to myself. Ain't no one else around. Chew my own goddamn ear off. I can imagine. Now, used to be mm. the gators was the worst thing in the bayou. Gators and snakes. I've been snake bit more times I like to remember. Ain't been gator bit though. Got that to be thankful for at least. Gator bites is nasty. Mm -hmm. Then turtle bites is bad too. They call them snapping for a reason. Yeah, well, I've been known to snap too. So, how about we keep it down? Oh, yes, partner. Yep. Uh huh. That's probably best. Hey! Damn bats. Don't you worry about no bats. I'll tell you when you got to worry, all right. Look at that. He fresh. You see what I mean? This night folk work. I knew this fella. Good fella. Didn't deserve this. Now come on. Damn. 
Slow down. Hey, hey. Poor fella on a tree been here for years. You think it's bad being a dead fella on a tree? It's worse when you're a live one with a stick through you. Lamps out. They might not speak, but they sure can see. Now, look out here. There's gators. What a place to make your home. It's nice, ain't it? There we go. Up there. Night folk up to all sorts. You go deal with them. I'll be here with my rat gun. Okay. Do what you can. Oh, they got someone. Ooh, poor fella. Hey. Clear off of there. Shit, they're coming. There's got to be more of them. Boy here. I'll see. I don't like this. Not at all. Se löi oikeesti. Joo, maketella.
hukkujunkkareita maketella nimenomaan. Well, boy, that's gotta be more of them. Here. I'll see. I don't like this. Not at all. Oh, no. More. Ah, devils. What is this? Swamp trash? No, that's some of the good stuff right there. You good man, mister. Damn decent. You sure you're gonna be okay? I'm a flood. Night folk won't come here anymore. They dumb, but they ain't stupid. Well, so long now. Perfect. Perfect peltejä pitkis saada. Tässä pelissä, jotta saa päivitettyä noita omia varusteita. Mä en ole yksinkertaisesti vaan viitsi nyt panostaa metsästykseen. Help a blind man. Okay, here you are. You didn't run when last we spoke, sir. You didn't run far enough. Uh, sure. Okay, mister. <laughs> All the best now. Okay, boy. I'm sure you got better things to do than follow a lame blind man. Kane. Of course I can. Said I would. There's a foreman. His name is Danbury. He's the files in the office above the refinery room. It's that window with the blind drawn up. I see. If the files are as incriminating as we believe, Mr. Cornwall's men will destroy them if they know you're coming. There's only one of me, son. I don't intend for them to know I'm coming. What will the files say? There'll be a report from Leyland Oil Development Company. And you got the money? Yes. Any ideas how I... Sneak into this place? You could crawl under the fence or hide in a wagon. They keep rolling in. I'll go take a look. If there's a problem, call for me. I thought the whole point was that this had nothing to do with you. Ideally. If you are quick, you could climb into the back of that wagon.
must be Danbury. What? Will you be quiet? Need a file by the Leland Oil Development Company. One about the oil near Wapiti. I... I... Danbury. Think, man. Mind is a terrible thing to lose. Especially over such a nice boy as this. You done good, Danbury. Real good. They'll give you a promotion for this. No. Danbury. Yes. All's fine. Now stay quiet. Or head office will send me back to get you. Just in time. I was happy to watch some of that oil burn. So you met Mr. Danbury? Yes, don't worry. He was very obliging. <laughs> I thought you wasn't getting involved. Thought you were going to enter and leave silently. Thank, Thank you. You, you saved my life. Thank you. I hope, well, I don't know what I hope, but who knows? Maybe these will be of some use. Here's your money. Thank you. Let's go, boy.
My name's William. Arthur. You familiar with the study of plants, my friend? Familiar ain't quite the word I'd use. Well, let me tell you. This great earth beneath our feet can provide everything man ever needs. But we've only reached a oh. tiny bit of its potential. You see, there are thousands, maybe millions of plants all across this vast country we share. The mountains. The plains, the swamps. I mean to explore them all. To know all of nature's bounty and all of her wonder, if I can. Sure. But I'm only one man. Would you consider helping me with gathering herbs for my studies? Why? Knowledge, kindness, beauty. Well, I'm ignorant, ugly, and nasty. <laughs> well... Let's see if maybe we can do something about that. I'll see. I'm looking for a plant called yarrow. You can distinguish it by its red flowers. It shouldn't be too hard to find. They thrive out in the open under direct sunlight. <laughs> Let's see how this tastes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I feel better already. They were right. This stuff does have medicinal properties. All this help, you deserve something in return. Well, this is for your horse. Save it for bad injuries. Heaven forbid your horse is in trouble. You'll be glad you had it. Now, if you don't mind, I'll be getting back to my studies. I look forward to our next meeting, Traveler. I can see why you do this. All the best to you. Thanks, Arthur. A and to you. Arthur, there you are. Come on. Thomas, let's get going. Right you are. Don't need <laughs> <laughs> hey, Bill, you were a sharpshooter in the cavalry, weren't you? What? When we get there, maybe you could help with the suppression fire. I never said I was no sharpshooter. Oh, that's right. W what was it? The nation's most loyal latrine digger, wasn't that it? <laughs> yeah, well, I fought, and I fought well. So you always tell us. You taught me something you could do with learning. <laughs> Them Indians were savages. Watch your mouth there, boy. Watch it. Only type of savage in these parts are moonshine, swilling pompous, inbred locals. Dutch, I saw things out there. I don't doubt you saw things, Bill, but your tiny little mind was too small to comprehend what you saw. What you saw was people who lost everything to savagery, savagery of peasants. Failures come from Europe to reap some awful vengeance on God's last creation. Interesting way you boys got to prepare for a killing. I'm sorry I wasted my life trying to teach you boys. Love you though I do. <clears throat> well, not leaving love aside. I... <coughs> you think we got this? Don't you never leave love aside, Arthur. It's all we got. Pick us up yonder. I got you. Thank you. Good luck to you. Come on, quick. Stay quiet. Plenty. Bill, 
You're with me. Arthur, John, you take the left side. If you see a shot, you take it. Okay? Good luck, gentlemen. Let's go. Never wear a dead man's hat, I always say. Shoot that lock, Arthur. Good. Now kick that damn door in. Thank you. 
Like I said, you carry him. I think Dutch wants to have a little chat, Mr. I'm in the front. Bill. Bill. Got him? Oh, come on, Lenny. Damn it. I'm going to present that. You're going to think Let's get out of here. Yep. Oh, hey, big man. We going to ransom you or what? Coyote Pussy. Oh, I am. Because from where I'm sitting, you're the one deserving of pity, my friend. <laughs> all your men, all your money, it weren't no match for a bunch of bumpkins. You are nothing. You do nothing, mean nothing, you stand for nothing. Me, I run a city. <laughs> and when the law catch up to you, you will die like nothing. I am this country. You, you, you are what people are running from. I possess things that you will never understand. You don't even possess your own men. A thousand dollars to the man who kills him and sets me free. What are you gonna say now? They are even bigger fools than you. No doubt. The law will find you. Already, the dogs are on the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're right. You are so right. right. They are good at smelling filth, huh? So <laughs> filth! has got to be disposed of! Oh, Our friends, the Pinkertons, are gonna come and rescue you, you uh, repulsive little maggot! Uh, oh, uh, 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 call them now! You call them! The goddamn alligator, Dutch. The part that covers weakness. That part. I don't know. Well, I do. It ain't nice. I know it. But it is us or him. 
I figure it might as well be him. Hmm.